Hello everyone! Today I'm going to be doing another get ready with me but today I'm also going to be um, doing my hair and I'm going to be doing my curly hair routine but not my full one because um, I'm just doing a refresh you know so yeah let's get into it okay so first I'm going to be doing my hair then I'll do my makeup but I'm going to wet my hair a little bit with this spray bottle and I'm going to brush it out the water's gonna make it easier to brush out because it's really tangled, as you can tell. So yeah. Okay, now that it's all wet and brushed out, our next step is we're gonna use some leave-in conditioner. Um, I'm using this Monday Moisture One. Really good. It has hyaluronic acid for dry and dull hair. Perfect, because my hair is dry and dull. So yeah, we're just gonna put this in and I'm gonna show you what technique I use for putting it in. So, just gonna do like maybe two squirts and rub it in my hands. And then we're gonna go from like our mids to ends because that's how conditioner works. Don't mind the noise in the background. That's just my sister and my mother. Okay. Once I'm done, see you when the other side has conditioner on it too. All right. Now that we have conditioner on both sides, I'm going to use this can to shea butter curl cream. Um, and I'm gonna use a lot of this because, you know, guys, you can never have too much curl cream, but, yeah. Then, rub it in my hands again. This time we're gonna put it all the way, like, like, in all of our hair, from root to tip. So I just like to like do but like my technique is like to go like this and like go like this like rake it through and also like go like that and you can have you can never have too much of this like I said like it's you know that you have enough when your hair goes like this and it's like kind of stiff but let me put some on the other side and i'll get to you guys okay now that your hair is looking like stiff and stuck together now we are going to scrunch and we're going to scrunch a lot a lot until our hands are very cramped up and our well not our hands our fingers are really cramped up and feel like they want to fall off so yeah this is like the fun part so i'll see you once my hands my fingers are really cramped up so this is the difference of the hair before and after the curling scrunching <laughs> i don't know why i said curling but let's do the other side all right now that we've been scrunching for like a lot um i'm gonna let my hair air dry so it's not that wet while i do my makeup so today's makeup is very simple i'm only gonna do few things first off obviously always moisturize all right next i'm doing my brows just gonna like um fill in the front a little bit and like straighten them out make them look good all right then i'm gonna curl my lashes this is like my favorite step other than the mascara, but yeah. Also, I do about like five times. 
See how long? So amazing. Then the other eye. A little bit of mascara, you know, the one I always use, the iconic Lowbrow Telescopic Lift. And as you know, our queen, Tate McRae, also uses this mascara. Well, at least maybe she used to. I don't know if she still uses it, but it's awesome. I feel awesome using it. Next, we're doing a little bit of concealer. Same one I used in the last Get Ready With Me. I put it on like this, a little bit in the corner like that, and then a little bit over here. Like that, and like that. And lastly, some lip gloss. I'm dead, my sister. I love this lip gloss. It's clear, it's glittery, and it's awesome. Did you tell them we're going to a clinic? They don't need to know that. Okay, everyone, thank you so much for watching. My hair is still not like fully dried yet, but when it is, I'm gonna put a little bit of oil in it and we have to leave soon, so I might not even be able to do that. Stop. But I recommend this Savage from Dior perfume. It's, it smells really good. But it's not even for girls. Anyways, guys, oh bye.